Hello everyone and welcome back to CWL Builds. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to turn this into this. Using very simple tools and techniques that anyone can do. Here's the final product. This project will only take you two to three hours max, and you can do it any way you please, using my video as more of a guidelines than exactly what you have to do. Well, I hope you guys enjoy, and I will see you at the end of the video. Okay, so I made this off camera. This is just a piece of one inch PVC with some couplings and an end cap. And you can make yours any configuration you want, any size, any shape, any number of twists and turns you want on it. This one's just a very simple version. I got all these pieces for under $5 from Home Depot. Now we come to the part where we make this look like a real rusty pipe. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna take this Rust-Oleum metallic spray paint and spray the whole thing. So I'll be right back. Okay, so the metallic paint has dried. Now it's time for the first layer of weathering. And for that, I'm going to be using black wash. Now, black wash is a mixture of black acrylic paint and isopropyl alcohol. And basically what you do is you take the paint, you put it into an old water bottle like this, you add the alcohol, you mix it up until you get a consistency about the thickness of milk or cream. And then we're going to take this, rub it on our pipe, let it dry for a couple minutes, and then rub most of it off with a clean towel or rag. And this will leave it looking really greasy and oily. If you don't have isopropyl alcohol, you can use water. It works just the same. I just use rub rubbing alcohol here because it dries faster. Okay, so the black wash has dried. Now it's time to put on the rust. So for the rust, I use the same sort of technique as the black wash. I take an old bottle, I add in a brown acrylic and a red acrylic. These are burnt umber and a red oxide. And I add about two to one ratio of two red, one brown. I add in my isopropyl alcohol, and then another addition that I add is dirt. Yeah, dirt. There's just regular dirt from my backyard. It's uh, sifted so that there's no rocks or sticks in there. And I added a little kosher salt and pepper as well, and that gives it this nice grainy texture to the rust paint that makes it look like the rust has eaten away the metal. There we have it, the rusty metal pipe is complete. This only took me about two hours, so it's a super easy one day build. It's strong, it's con safe because it's plastic. This would be great for a cosplay, maybe Fallout or Left 4 Dead or an independent movie perhaps. 
You could put a cool leather wrapped handle on here, maybe some cloth. I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to wrap it in some cloth. But very simple build. You can design it any way you want, like I said earlier. Any configuration. Super easy. Very cool looking. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you might like some of my other ones. I have up here the Dark Saber build, and over here I have the Bath Tokens from Spirited Away. Thank you again for watching, and I hope you enjoyed.